The highs are, let me tell you, 18 months ago, it didn't exist. Within 18 months, I've seen, at least in KL, the city, KL city, people are like, oh, I've heard about the hype. People told me to go. I haven't had a chance to go. So I see the movement is growing and the awareness is starting to grow. We do a lot of, uh, we work with local organic farmers. We get zero money from the local organic farmers, deliver their farmer's basket here at the hive. People already pre-order and pick it up from here. We work with all the local uh, community. We work with our bread maker, our, all our cosmetic suppliers, honey suppliers, they're all based in KL. So KL, the, the hive will only keep on growing. And if people keep on buying, we'll have more and more local suppliers. The tips to start living zero waste is actually worldwide the same. You remove one disposable, uh, whatever it is, to use and to switch for, you swap it for a reusable. If you have coffee every day with your takeout cup, you bring your own tumbler. If you buy every day a water bottle, you bring your own water bottle you, and you put a filter at the office or you have a system that works for you. Uh, if you have takeout every day that you bring in the office, you bring your teeth in. Zero waste living and having a healthy lifestyle are correlated. Why? Because if you eat zero waste, it's unpackaged food, meaning unprocessed food most likely. So you eat, uh, if it's unprocessed food, you go to the hive and you buy all your bulk organic or natural food. It's one ingredient, you buy quinoa, you buy your rice, you buy your wheat and you mix it some with some nuts or with some uh, spices, you buy all organic here and you have add a little bit of protein from vegetables or tofu or some legumes you buy here. Everything is unprocessed, you will automatically lose weight. Automatically. Plus, there's again, you will save money. If you buy local organic food, you will save money. Why people are buying all those fancy foods, superfood products from USA, from Australia, I don't get it. We have plenty of amazing food here, local food. I think I'm very positive. I'm probably one of the only ones who's super positive about it. I think uh, the zero waste movement is really growing. We had our first zero waste feast last year, last December. Bea Johnson came from the US, she was doing an Asia tour, she came here to KL. We had thousands of people on that day who came. I think the population is ready. Uh, we're all sick and tired of being sick. We have pollution of the air, pollution of the water, pollution of the food. I mean, those are the three primary products we need to be alive on this planet. Uh, so I think people are really aware and they again see the correlation between waste, health and well-being in general, uh, because I'm talking about as well as me well mental being. Being a minimalist has a lot of mental wellness about it. So I think within the next few years, the scene will change. Man. When you press me to your...